Hi, uh, welcome to this new video about angular velocity. In this case, uh, we're going to solve a problem, you know, about a model uh, where we know the equation for the angular velocity. So we're going to be using some tools of calculus to solve this problem. Before starting with the solution, I will invite you to uh, subscribe to our channel so you can just get notifications of all the new mm, problems we're going to be solving in the future. So the problem says that the angular velocity of a process control model is omega equals 20 minus 1 over 2t squared in radians per second, where t is in seconds. At what time does the model reverse direction? Through what angle does the model turn? between t equals zero second and the instant at which is reverse direction. So we know that to reverse direction, so for the model to reverse direction, the angular velocity omega must be zero. So we're going to get the equation of angular velocity we have here. That is 20 minus 1 over 2t squared. And we're going to make it equal to 0 to find, you know, at what time the model is going to reverse direction. So we can say that this would be just 20 equals 1 over 2t squared. So 40 equals t squared, so t is equals plus minus t squared root of 40, so t is equals approximately, you know, plus minus 6.3 seconds. Uh, the negative solution here don't make sense, right? That the negative solution doesn't make any sense, so we are going just to take only a solution of this equation the positive time, that is 6.3 seconds. So we know that the model will reverse direction at time equals 6.3 seconds. Now let's say to what angle that the model turn between t equals 0 second and the instant, uh, which is reverse direction. So we know the relation that exists between the angle and the angular velocity. So we know that angular velocity is this here at t. If we solve for zeta, we, we get that this zeta is equal to w or omega dt. So if we apply integral, we're going to get that zeta is the integral of omega dt. So what I have to do is to evaluate, you know, this function to find the integral of this function and to evaluate that, you know, in the uh, or in the limits from 0 to 6.3 seconds. So basically I'm going to say that 0 would be the integral from 0 to 6.3 seconds of 20 minus 1 over 2 t squared dt. So uh, if we find that integral, we're going to get 20t minus 1 over 6t to the third. And we're going to evaluate that, you know, from 0 to 6.3 seconds. So if we do it, we get a zeta is equal to 20 times 6.3 minus 1 over 6, 6.3 to the third. So that would be basically 84 radians. So to the question, to what angle does the model turn between t equals 0 seconds and the instant at which it reverse direction, we can say that the angle in this case is equal to 84 radians. Thank you for the attention and remember to subscribe to 
these channels. Thank you.